fan of our videos, be sure to subscribe to Floppy Cats and ring the bell to be notified of our latest videos. Hi Floppy Catters, we got something new in the mail today. These are Cat Amazing Sliders, which are cat puzzle toys that you put together. And many, many years ago, we did a video on the Cat Amazing puzzle toy. So I will link to that or show it in this video and then link to it below. And my cats loved it. My cats love puzzle toys. They are a great activity for your cat if they're bored. And given the fact that a lot of us are either required to be quarantined or are self-quarantining or have kids out of school because of shutdowns, this is an excellent thing to bring into your home because not only does it take a little time to put together, but it also helps challenge the brain. It helps, you can color it. There's a multitude of things. So without further ado, I'll open her up. All right, so this is how it comes. It's falling because it's slippery cardboard, but this is how it comes and then you end up putting it together. So I will work on that and then we'll move forward. So it, ha it comes with a good instruction thing. We'll get that done. You wanna come see what's this one? What's this one? Oh, whoa. You know what this one? No? Both of my cats are napping right now, so I'll go ahead and put this together, but um, you could certainly make it an activity with your cats or have your kids make an activity with your cats. What do you think? Oh, you're so beautiful. Look, you got this one. All right. See, hey, there's lots of pieces and parts. Okay, it looks like they have an assembly video so that you don't have to read the instructions, so you could do that or you can follow the instructions to do it and it says first assemble the yellow slider following the steps below make sure the small tabs along the lock firmly into the slots along the base assemble the small green and purple sliders the same way so if you've ever put together those like i i had to do this my in my dad's office one um, winter break but put together like hundreds of those cardboard file boxes um, that's, that's what this reminds me of. ones are put together and I would say the purple and the green are the most difficult to put together without a doubt. So then um, step two is going to be these parts I think the big guy. Uh, so this one actually has a glue strip here and it says peel the glue strip on the side, tab of the outer shell, line it carefully with the other. So this needs to be bent. So we'll bend that take off the glue strip. The design lines up, so that is how you can easily tell how to line it up. So hopefully I did that correctly. And then there's a bottom. So this is probably the bottom. So this is the bottom that I'm putting in now. All right, and there's the top, or there, there's the bottom installed. Now unfold the white insert and press open until it's a square on the side. Okay. Place the yellow insi slider inside of it, solid side down. Okay, so solid side down. So this slot 
needs to align here. So what this is, is a multi-level cat puzzle toy. And so I've just inserted the first level, if you will. Okay, and then we put the purple and the green up here. Oh, now you're gonna come see it. I think that's an excellent idea, sir. Yes. I'm gonna put some cheats in the ears. Let me put some cheats in the ears. I've talked about this before. Anytime that you get something new, um, you wanna let your cats smell it and be involved in it as long as it's safe for them. So, looks like you're gonna go in the ears. Okay. All right, looks like you just add that top here. And yes, I know that it looks like Charlie's more interested in the box it came in. But once this has treats in it, that ain't gonna be the case. So there's a little opening here where you keep, keep open. <laughs> you line the lid with that side. So, all right. Cool. So that is it. Now, it's time to put some treats in there and see what happens. All right, here we go. You want some of these ones in there? All right, everybody knows that we like whole life treats, so that's what we're gonna use to put in here. This cat's gonna be entertained for hours trying to get these out. Woo, that's another one to figure out. How you get those out of the ears? How you get those out of the ears? <laughs> Not so sure. You might try to make some easier ones at first, just so, you know, they don't get discouraged or frustrated or aggravated like, like I would if someone made a puzzle really difficult. My dad um, used to give us a puzzle every um, every Christmas. He put like, you know, a dollar bill, not a dollar, but he put like a 20 or 50 um, in these plastic puzzles that in order to get the money out, you had to solve the puzzle. And he, um, I've got freeze dried chicken dust on my fingers. So that's what he's going for. But Anyway, he would give us these puzzles and uh, totally laugh and delight as my siblings and I tried to figure out how to get the money out. Um, so that's why I say don't frustrate or aggravate your poor cat. But well, you got to get this one. Come over to yours. <laughs> Did you give up? Get it. You got it. It's right there, Woo. You got it, Woo. Cat Amazing actually sent us two of their sliders toys. So I took one over to my sister Amy's house for her cats, Addie That's and Ash, true. to product review simultaneously while my cats, Charlie and Trig, are reviewing. So you'll see all four cats in the final review video. We always take four to six weeks to review a product. So in that time, it's really cool. A lot of Flappy catters will go ahead and buy the Cat Amazing sliders, and then um, they offer even additional commentary throughout the review process, which is really cool. Um, and then also it gives me a chance from the unboxing to the review to know what you guys are looking for, what questions you have about this. So be sure to include those in the comments below so that I can, you know, I, I basically make a list of those and then try to tackle those concerns in the final review video. Uh, this one's a little bit frustrated at this point, but this one, um, but it looks like Chiggy's going after it, which he doesn't usually. But what's this one right there? But what I'm guessing is that all of this will be empty overnight. And that's, which is something really cool about cat puzzle toys. Um, if your cats aren't like totally <laughs> aggressive and destructive, there are some cats that are like that because people have told me, you know, like my cat destroyed the, a cardboard cat puzzle toy. My cats don't destroy them. They don't really, um, 
well, my experience has been that they don't destroy them. This is great. That's something to leave out overnight and have them be entertained without waking me up. I used to say in our videos, this is a great thing to, you know, leave while you go to work or something like that. But uh, most of us aren't going to work right now. So it's just something maybe to leave when you don't want to be bothered overnight, for example. And then this is what I'm talking about. You know, you could have your kids or grandkids or whatever color all of this and have a lot of fun. Just make sure that they're non-toxic markers, non-toxic to cats and kids. All right, guys, that wraps it up for now. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to ask. If you want me to cover anything in the final review video, please include that as well. Are you going to go? You better go get those ones. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Thank you so much for watching. If you haven't already, please consider subscribing to our free weekly newsletter that goes out on Wednesdays. I'll include a link to it in the About section below. We'll see you next time.